want to break past the default two-page spreads in InDesign for brochures, menus, book covers, proposal foldouts, or any kind of document. In this quick tutorial, I'll show you the very simple, but very not obvious, way of making any spread in any InDesign document into one, two, three, four, or more pages per spread. Another very common question I hear is, how do I create spreads with more than two pages? People want to do that for foldouts or for working with book covers where one spread contains the front cover, the back cover, and the spine, or a number of other types of layouts where multiple pages in a spread can be useful. Here I've got a document where I've numbered every page manually. These are not automatic page numbers. So as I drag them around, these page numbers will not change. That allows you to follow what I'm doing as I drag things around. So here, and I'll just go ahead and expand my pages panel a little bit. And now if I take this page, let's say I want pages two, three, and four to be in a single spread, a three page spread. And I take page four and I try to drag it up here and drop it. You can see apparently nothing happened. Something did happen, but if I, drag five, you can see it shuffles. It does wind up after page three, but InDesign is forcing the pages into a two page spread. So five stays after three. Let me put that back. And now what it's doing is no matter what I do, if I take five and I drag it up in between them and drop it, I still get two page spread. So let me undo that with command Z or control Z. Then if I go to the pages panel flyout menu, and choose allow document pages to shuffle. Notice how that's turned on, there's a check mark. Select it to turn it off. Now I'm gonna take page five and I'm gonna drop it in between pages two and three and you can see I now have a three page spread. That's the secret. Allow document pages to shuffle. If you want only two page spreads, leave that on, which is it is by default. If you want a spread that's more than two pages, or fewer than two pages, if you want a single page spread, go ahead and turn that off and it allows you to drag your pages around and create any arrangement you need. That's all there is to it. With just a couple of clicks, you can activate InDesign's ability to make spreads of any number of pages for layouts like a book cover, front cover, spine, and back cover, gatefold and accordion fold brochures and invitations, multi-panel brochures, storyboards, Leporello, or concertina layouts for timelines and art books, and even large format exhibits and trade show booth panels. Now go design something cool.